Hello everyone, this is me Sadia here and I'm back with another bonus love read which is going to be for the next 48 hours in love. Let's find out what's going to come in for you in the next 48 hours in your love life. Just be mindful that it's a general read, it may, it may not resonate with everyone out there. Pick whatever resonates and leave the rest. For personal reads, you can always reach out to me on my email ID. In the description box, you can also check out other services that I offer as well in the description box. So let's see what's coming in for you in the next 48 hours in your love life. Let's find out. It's a collective read. So if you're watching this, it's a sign it is going to happen for you. Let's begin. Four of Pentacles, the Sun, the Hermit. Under the deck, we do have Ten of Cups. Wow. I really feel like, you know, if there has been somebody in your life that you have been trying to manifest badly, I really see that you are going to see divine um, alignment taking place in your life around that particular connection. I really feel like, you know, if there has been a person that you were dealing with who was holding back, who was not giving into the connection, who was not opening up about their feelings, intentions, I really see this person opening up about it. You are going to have a joyful news coming your way in your love life in uh, the next 48 hours. And I really feel like, you know, you are going to start feeling good again. I feel for majority of you, you have been waiting for the sign. Uh, you have been waiting for some sort of a divine intervention in this situation. Maybe things have been stuck and stagnant in your love life with this person for quite some time. Um, if you are completely single, you might have been having a lot of thoughts and fears around, you know, when will you find love? Will it ever happen even? And all those things. But I really see you having a joyous news to come true for you in your love life, which is going to brighten and lighten all and everything. I really feel for majority of you, um, I really see somebody who's mature, um, open up about their feelings to you. Somebody who is ready and ready to kind of handle situations. Somebody, if they have been like, you know, if you are dealing with someone who has been running away from facing this reality and taking action, they will be taking action in the next 48 hours. And I really see you having a very fulfilling experience in your love life in the next 48 hours. For those of you who are already married, um, the next 48 hours is going to be a good family time together. Um, I really feel like, you know, for majority of you, um, you might be getting some sort of, uh, you know, news to celebrate with the, with the close people that you have in your life. Um, and I really feel like, you know, this is something which is... Um, which everybody has been waiting for in your family, in your in your close circle. And you are going to feel very joyful because this news that I see coming in for you, it is something which is going to add not just uh, emotional stability, but uh, financial stability to you and your life as well. So I really feel like, you know, for majority of you, if you have started feeling losing hope or giving up on something don't do that because something beautiful is going to happen in the next 48 hours and you are going to get excited again i feel for some of you you might have already lost the hope which is the why which is the reason why i see this person here the hermit card and the hermit energy i really feel like you know you have a kind of like you know thought that maybe things things are never going to get you know the way you desire but that is going to change in the next 48 hours in your love life you will receive some joyous news and uh Something beautiful is going to start taking place for you in your love life. So don't give up. There is beautiful energy entering in your life in the next 48 hours. I really feel like it's going to happen after six hours from now onwards, whenever you're watching this read, um, you will receive some joyous news and that's going to make you feel so happy and excited. So six hours from now onwards, something is going to happen. Something big is going to happen. Let's see. Um, what else do you need to know about the next... Uh, 48 hours in your love life. What else do you need to know about the next 48 hours in your love life? What else do you need to know about the next 48 hours in your love life? What else do you need to know? Okay. Big change is coming in. We do have the world energy here. So I really feel like, you know, your life, if has been stuck and stagnant, big movement ahead i mean the deck we do have knight of souls i really see some action taken here and i really feel like you are on the receiving end of the action here coming from someone specific in your love life um let's see um what's the divine message for you for the next 48 hours in love let's see the divine message for you um 
let's see the divine message for you for the next 48 hours in love Ooh, go outside it's time to go outside time uh, tune into the power of peace of nature wherever you are and feel at one with your habitat i really feel like you know the divine really want you to stay calm at peace from within um spend some time out in the nature because when you do that um, you are able to pick up signs and messages coming from the divine. You will be able to pick up the loving energy of the universe that's always around you, surrounding you all the time. So try to feel at peace from within and try to feel one with the habitat and try to know and understand the divine messages that has been coming for you in recent times, but you might have been unable to pick them up. Let's see some more messages here. Uh, what else do you need to know about your love life for the next 48 hours? Boundaries. You need to teach people how to treat you by being clear on what you will or you won't allow. I feel like, you know, for majority of you, um, you need to know one thing. Like, you know, you have to have a solid, strong boundaries in love. Um, make sure that, you know, you're not letting people cross the boundaries because if that has been happening, you have to stop it. I feel like, you know, if you have been doing that, that might be the reason why people have been taking you for granted. So make sure that you don't do that. Uh, make sure that you have strong boundaries so people respect that. Make sure that they do value those boundaries as well. Uh, the divine really want you to kind of like, you know, take stand for yourself and let people know that you're worthy of what you're asking for. Don't let them make you feel bad for, for you know, um, being your true self. Um, just, just know that healthy boundaries are healthy for healthy relationships. And if people have complaints around it, I feel like, you know, they are not worth your time. So let's see. What else do you need to know about your love life? Oh, wow. So we do have a twin flame card here. This person is your mirror soul. This is why this connection feels so sacred to you. So for some of you, you are dealing with a twin flame here and, um, Redirect your thoughts. Focus on what you want to attract in this relationship, not on what you fear will happen. So for some of you, again, if you have been having a lot of fearful thoughts, that if I really want you to go outside, feel the love that is surrounded, you know, that is surrounding you right now. And don't let the fear creep in. Don't let the doubts creep in. Don't feel like, you know, oh my God, you did not create the boundaries. Now you will suffer. No, just Switch your thoughts to what you want, what you desire. You want your person to value you for who you are. You want your person to love you for who you are. You want your person to give you exactly what you want. So make sure you bring your focus to the things um, that you desire in your relationship. And that's exactly what is going to happen. If you are feeling like giving up on your dreams, desire and goal, because you're fearful, maybe it is not going to happen. It's time for you to redirect your thoughts to what you want, what you desire, not the opposite. So yeah, that's uh, pretty much it coming up for you in uh, your love life in the next 48 hours. And claim this energy. And if you're willing to purchase any of the services that I offer, check the description box for that. And if you're willing to purchase affirmations for the month of March, check the description box for that. Till I do the next read, take care. Bye.